on this video i would like to share with you guys what are the things that you can do uh, to make some side incomes yeah or in us they call it side hustles to make some side incomes one of the easiest way you know, will be doing youtube videos of course that is also if you can get 1000 subscribers with 4000 hours of view time uh, within a year so that is also one year later you can be able to monetize uh, some cash you know from youtube that is actually what uh, i want to prove to you guys uh, i am actually making a bit of uh, side income right now just because i have uh, reached 1000 subscribers okay, i have I have get more than 4000 hours long time back yeah just that i don't get 1000 subscribers yet so i've just gotten it and now money starts rolling in but it's not a lot yeah, I think within a month I'll be able to get uh two or three hundred ringgit, but that is actually good enough for me. I'll be able to cover my uh unified bill, yeah. And electricity bill maybe. You'll be seeing that you know two three hundred is so little. But the thing is, it's a continuous thing. Yeah. The more videos like such as this video, yeah, the more video that I do, you know, meaning that more viewers are going to view it and there will be more money coming in yeah from the advertisements that that uh, people are actually viewing so um yeah by the way I just want to tell you guys you know youtube are actually paying uh 50 over percent of the advertising fees to you guys yeah and uh, they are keeping 40 over percent of it so i was thinking yeah why not you know create some content you know share it to the world and make some money out of it yeah. next what else you can do to get some side income you can become an uh, affiliate for Amazons, for Lazada. What you can really do is that go to their uh, Amazon Affiliates program, uh, go to their website and start signing up. Then you can make some videos or you can you know share in your blogs. Uh, make sure that you get the link right. And when people actually click on the link um, and if they purchase anything, then you're able to get some commission out of it yeah that's for amazon uh lazada um i've not tried it yet but i think it's about the same so these are the things that you don't need to go out there you know to get side incomes you know you can just do it right in your house yeah and just do it uh using your own free time uh if you think that's too little then another side income that you can do is being a grab driver yeah, in US it's called Uber, Uber driver. But in, in Southeast Asia, I think uh, Grab have actually taken over all the market. Being a Grab driver, I've heard that you can mix almost five figures a month if you are really if you're really good, you know, from morning until night. I'm I don't know, out twenty four hours you only need eight hours of sleeping, then the rest of the hours you go to you'll be in a car. Well, you can do that if you want to, but uh, right now during the lockdown, during the MCO, uh, because of the COVID-19, I think that will be uh, heavily affected. You won't be able to get as much of uh, passengers right now, um, but still, it's a uh, side income, yeah? So, next, what else you can do? You can become a um, food delivery person. Yeah, if you have a motorcycle, the beauty of doing food deliveries like Food Panda, like uh, Grab Food, Hungry, I think there's a few more. Yeah, but uh, Asia as well. Yeah, they're also having some food delivery services. But my suggestion would be good for Food Panda because the coverage is huge. Yeah, but of course you will also have a lot of uh, competition because there are a lot of people out there who is already doing it. So. It really depends on how you look at it. Yeah, if you find that too many competitions, then go for grab. Then if not, then go for hungry. Um, I've heard that people are making quite a bit. Yeah, almost five figures during this uh lockdown MCO period time because people aren't going out to eat. They are getting food deliveries, uh, food delivered to their house. What is the fifth side income that I think that you can do? Well. It's also delivery but you know, it's not food uh, it's not people but you're delivering parcels yep parcels so 
you can actually go to uh, Oslaju and register as their agent. Then you can start, you know, deliver things for them. Yeah. And instead of just that, I think there's a lot more. Yeah, JNT. Um, you can also look, book with uh, Lazada Express. Book with uh, Shopee. Shopee Express, not mistaken. Yeah. And people nowadays are buying things online every single day. The parcels volume are going up tremendously. So what else you can do to earn some money? Um, selling things online. Yes. Selling online would be, uh, maybe you think that you don't have anything to sell, but you know, anything is possible. If you if you can do some handicraft, you know, um, things that you, you, only you will be able to make. Yeah. Uh, put it on Shopee, put it on Lazada, you know, it doesn't cost you anything to open a shop in Shopee or, or Lazada, you know, you just need to put it in there um, and just wait for it, yeah, price it lower if you're not selling, even lower after that until it starts to sell, until it starts to sell, then you think that, okay, this is the right price because this is why people are buying, you need to take a very nice photograph out of it, go out to the sun, under the sun, uh, take a very nice photograph of what you have made and you know sell it to the world maybe not to the world but at least to the local communities yeah. I do hope that all the tips here will be able to help you to, to figure out uh, to get how to get side incomes or side hustles you know, out of six definitely you can choose one thanks for watching and uh, hope you can make money out of the tips I have given you Bye.